Tips from Career Source. I'm Kelly Golubin and welcome to Computer Tips. Today we're going to learn how to create a signature in Outlook and add a logo to that signature. You can see we're already logged in to Outlook, so let's jump right in. Click on the file menu, upper left, and this will take us to our options. Click on the options button and this opens up our screen that lets us modify many of the features in Outlook. We are going to explore many of these later, but for the time being, let's go to Mail. Here we can make changes such as using stationery, but for today's lesson, we're going to create a signature for message. So go ahead and click on the Signatures button. So if you already had any signatures, you would see them listed here. We have none because we're going to create a new one from scratch. Go ahead and click on the new button. And now we'll give our signature a name. I'm just going to give it the name signature and hit OK. And then we'll actually type our name, title, company name in this box down below. So go ahead and put in your name and your title, spelled correctly, is best. I'm going to put in the company name. And now I want to add a logo that will fill in below. So if we come over to the right and click on this insert picture icon, that will take us to our pictures folder. You can use the computer to navigate to wherever you have stored the pictures. It could be desktop. I've chosen to put it in the pictures library, but it can really be stored wherever you like. I'm going to click on the Rolling Stones icon and hit insert. The image appears, appears below everything looks good. If we wanted to make any modifications to our signature such as increasing the size of our font, we can do so here. Changing the font type, we can do so here as well. I'm going to go with that. Looks good. And hit OK. And hit OK again to close this dialog box. When we come over to create a new email, our signature automatically appears below. That's it for today. We'll see you next time.